Hey everybody, welcome back to Super Auto Pets. It's been a while. I had a hankering to play a little bit of it and I've had the perfect excuse. This is just gonna be a super chill episode. I mean, I guess my other ones aren't exactly, you know, high strung. But the, my main reason for doing this is that I'm changing my recording software very slightly. Although I might switch between the two. So here's the story before we get into the game. We'll, we'll have the story, I'll set the scene. I've been recording everything onto YouTube in OBS Studio. I don't think that's unusual. It's a nice bit of free software. It works very well. Very nice. Chef kiss. However, recently I've noticed upon playing Hearthstone that for some reason my internet keeps cutting out on this PC. And I've linked it to OBS Studio. I don't know what's happening and it doesn't happen every time. But because it's like every so often it just cuts out completely like, and I have to fully reset you know, my internet, reset the Wi-Fi, reset the router. It's just annoying me. So I'm now testing out Streamlabs instead, you know, Streamlabs OBS, to see if this will, you know, stop the issues. So I wanted to pick an, like, an online game that, you know, isn't too messy, and I picked Super Auto Pets. It's really strange. It just came on suddenly. I don't know what happened. I don't know if it's an update to my computer, an update to OBS, but whatever it is, I've copied the settings over. So this stream, I say this stream, this recording is mainly to test this out. But the other reason from this, and I guess we can have this as, you know, like a little, a channel update video as well. I'm looking at doing a live stream. I'm probably going to do it sometime next week, but I'll put a separate video out just to announce it. Because I know not everyone checks out Super Auto Pets. I, and I'm, I honestly, I want to say that I'm going to do it just so, you know, I do it. Because otherwise I'll just keep putting it off, putting it off, putting it off. And eventually, you know, it's going to be Christmas. So I want to do a one-off stream for now. I will probably stream Alina of the Arena and I'll probably stream it via Streamlabs because I've been having some issues, as I said, with OBS, with cutting out my internet. So my internet's a bit sketchy as it is anyway, and I'm running it on Wi-Fi on my recording setup. So I'm going to see what... The stream is like so i'll let you know as i said what's going to happen when it's going to happen it'll almost certainly be alina i'm looking at sometime next week it's probably going to be next weekend at some point and it's almost going to be a test stream don't worry by the way if you don't catch it uh i will record the vod as well and i'll upload the vod separately and it'll be a nice little you know interaction experience but anyway that's basically the gist of things the one disadvantage, by the way, because I've copied all my settings over, so it should be fine. But let me know if, like, the audio sounds awful, like, you know, the peaking's terrible, or, like, the video quality is garbage. Like, I'm looking at it in the, the capture right now, and it seems okay to me right now, but you never know when, like, I'm not looking, something might happen. Then I can troubleshoot it. Uh, where was I going with this? But, yeah. It should be the same. The only downside I can see at the moment for recording for like YouTube purposes with Streamlabs is there's no pause function. Which either means I will have to edit it or more likely if I ever have to, you know, go to the toilet or answer the phone, you're gonna have to suck it up and leave with the minute pause because I'm not gonna edit it out. But I think what will end up happening, my very final like result from this is that I will record for YouTube in OBS Studio and I'll record to like stream in Streamlabs. It's a bit messy, it's not really what I want, but Hey ho, here we are. Anyway, enough chit chat. We're gonna play the weekly uh, pack. And let's see what we can do. <laughs> you can tell I've not played for a while, I've got the Christmas hats on still. Uh, gain plus one plus one per friend with a faint ability. Start a battle. Well, that seems like a no brainer. I don't know any of the balance patches, by the way. I will be completely honest. Two health. I've not really been keeping up to date with this. But I tell you what, I like otters, and we'll try this Frill Dragon. I believe the pig had been changed to a 4 1 last time I was still playing. Uh, it will be the Lush Legends. How appropriate, you know, for when I come back to the game to give me the legend title. It's as if it knows. Right, how are you going to get through my 3-4 answer? You're not. By the way, I didn't check what's in this pack, so I have no idea what the best synergies are. Ooh, this looks pretty spicy, though. Uh, do I put an otter on an otter? I think I do here. Good, good, good. 
very good. I like, I mean, I like all of the pets, honestly. Oh, the duck is 2-3. I think that has been changed as well last time I was playing. I was playing on the online variant, you know, on the, the beta test. I've not actually checked it out since it went live. As you may have saw from the previous screen, I've not bought the expansion pack yet. I probably will at some point if I start to get back into this again. But I'm, I'm happy enough with this board. Okay. Ooh, what are you now? Set attack to two instead of one. So they've changed the cockroach. Okay. Don't know if that really moves the needle for the cockroach, but... By the way, is the sound insanely loud? Yes. I don't know why. Raccoon. Before attack, steal held food of enemy ahead. Works one time per turn. Okay. Before faint, give honey to all pets that are one space away. I mean, you can see where this could go. Is this counted as a faint trigger? For you? I mean, I bought it now, so... I'm not sure if that's a faint ability, but it says before faint. Hmm. But I'm kind of liking the idea of grabbing this raccoon, stealing the food, but I think that's a bit too much, honestly. You know what, this guy? Bear? 3 5? That's a pretty good, healthy body. Take a bit of meat. Put some meat on them bones, and I'll freeze a pill. I love pilling ants. Goldfish, start to turn. Discount the two leftmost shot pets by one. Hmm. That seems really good. Okay, it's the ant squad. Alone they are weak, but together they are strong. Oh, you honey the other unit as well. Hmm. Okay. All pets are a space away. Interesting. Uh, is the swan still cracked? It's no longer a 2... Th oh, no, it used to be... What was it? A 2-3 or a 3-4? It's only a 1-3 now. All right. Sell. Pill. I'll keep the bear. I'm intrigued by the bear. Before faint... Uh, give me a swan and roll me. Enemy summoned up push, do one damage to it. That's not really what I'm after. <laughs> Let's grab another ant. I'm not scared to run a four squad martyr. You know this for, by now from me. We're not really on a summon build, so no boogie woogie tonight. Okay, it does count as a faint trigger. Okay, the honey kind of worked against me there. Sure. <laughs> Hello, Blowfish. Uh, pivot to Blowfish build? No, it's too late. It's simply too late. Honestly, this Frilled Dragon could also go at this point. I'm not exactly sold on the Frilled Dragon. I'm just considering whether or not I even buff it. Hmm. Hmm. I think we look for better tier 3 pets. Okay. Don't mock me, game. Sure, another bear. I guess it kind of synergizes with the dog a little bit. But it's not exactly, again, what I'm after. The oh, shrimp is in the pack. Pug, start the battle. Give friend Ed one experience. Mmm. Mmm. 
I think I will sell... Ah, do I want to sell the otter? Uh, you're... I mean, you're... Wait, hang on, sorry. Her friend with faint ability. Maybe I do sell the swan. For a bit of survivability for now. It is a 2-4, though. Okay, let's sell the otter. We've seen otters before. We know what they do. I will honey you instead. And this is starter battles. So why not throw you at the front instead? And maybe we'll have a, a honey bears at the back. Okay. I, I kind of want to do the cascade build. For all times. Don't see any hedgehogs, but... Everything else seems to be here. Okay, you hit the best target with weakness. Congratulations. The ox seems to still be insane. Yep, ox is still insane. Okay. The turtle has to be the right play here. Okay. Give you some melon. More melons? Or no more melons? I don't really need the melon. Mm, I think we rolled three times. Okay, that's a tear up on the swan. Deal 50% attack damage to adjacent pets. Okay, so Honey Badger still exists as a slightly weakened variant. It used to be 100%, right? I think they, they brought that back again on the beta. Oh, running with an ox at the front. Very bold strategy. Okay, can we get through the 110 swan? Oh yeah, obviously. I've got some rams. I forgot about the rams. Mole, give adjacent friends plus one plus one. All right. Moose, give plus one plus one to one pet behind. Multiply buff with lowest pet tier in shop. Uh, <laughs> this two, three head for me. I don't know why I said three head either, but you know what? I'll I'll, st I'll stick with it. So I think Swan can stay for a while. Eh, uh, Sheep, do I want you to stay? I don't know. We have no one with the Hurt ability. Let's do something like this. Give me a Molly Molly. Give me a Sheep. And you know what? Let's try and get the Moose loose. About this Oose. I'll drop you here. Okay, we were always going to roll into that. What the hell are you? Hurt, deal six damage back to the pet that hurt Porcupine. All right, I'll bite. <laughs> we're pivoting. It's the, the Turbo Porcupine. And by Porcupine, I mean Blowfish. God damn you. Okay, that's why you don't have your sheep at the back. You are pretty spooky, Lynx. Holy moly. Okay, we're one defeat away. Is the time to be pivoting now? Absolutely not. Am I going to pivot still? Yeah, absolutely. Give me a porcupine. So if he gets hurt, then... It does six damage back. That's really, really good damage. If we're doing this, you're going to go. Uh, I'm going to keep you frozen for a second. Bye, Sal. The Giga Pivot. The pivot to these pivot of all times. 
Can I afford to do this? Buy, buy, sell for two. I can. Is this stupid? Yes. Do I love it? Yeah. Also, I can't afford it. <laughs> I won gold off and forgot the pill cost money. Uh, okay. Well. I'm not afraid to run a three squad martyr. Ooh. Just pray. Pray with me. Oh, he gets one shot. Well, we meloned that at least. How could this happen to me? Now that I think about it as well, the bear at the back is really bad because of honey. Okay. That was just to get our eye back in again. Fish, otter, and another otter. I understand this. I've seen these pets before. I remember them well. Will be the the withering pieces, because honestly, I, I'm withering on the vine right now. A 6-3 golden poop pig. You hate to see it. Okay. Ant me, fish me, roll me. Anything here that really thrill me? Frill dragon kind of thrills me. I <laughs> get it, frill, frill. But he's still only a 2-3. I might as well buy a duck for that. It, it's just the full pack one build, or the standard pack, whatever it was called. Uh, damn, those cockroaches. They say you only can survive nuclear war. Maybe they were right. Maybe they were right. Uh, do I want a, a slightly buffed swan? Yeah, sure. Do I want the raccoon? Maybe, honestly. Do something like that? Yeah. Just freeze everything on site. It's old school meets new school. You have giraffe swan. I respect that you ran three squad Marty. I've done something wrong with the raccoon. He didn't steal the food. Steel held food. Oh, it's before attack. Oh, so you want to be at front and center. You steal their food. All right, I'm willing to see how this goes still. It's not as good as I thought it was. Well, I say that. Maybe it is as good as I thought it was. Broccoli's been changed. It used to be minus two, minus... Uh, sorry, plus four. It's minus one, plus three. Hmm. I mean, on the swan, that's just gravy, right? Because it can't go to zero health. I don't think I freeze this, but... Right. Okay, you have no food at the front. I love the picture of the raccoon. It just looks like a, a, a thug. It's like, oi! You... Oh my god, I got done in by the, the seven attack beaver. Like, he's like starting a riot. He predicts a riot. Alright. Hawk, welcome to the squad. We'll put you at the back, because I think that is the most disruptive position I can put you in. Then we have the question again. Do I just roll? I think I just roll right now. Let's see what the raccoon does now. Works two times per turn. Interesting. Crow for experience. You're a cell. I could humor this. Yeah, I'll humor that. Another swan? Why not? Enough. Honestly, if we're buying and selling, let's do that. What goes next? Probably otter. Ha ha ha! Cricket. It's mine! 
Ooh, and that's mine. I'm sold. The raccoon better unit. The thievery, the skullduggery, I love it. Right, who do I want to give an experience to? Kind of the fish. But mainly so that I can just get rid of it. Ooh. Ooh, I don't think if I do. This seems pretty offensive. I think we're definitely riding the crest of the wave again. Alright, your full death rattle build. Don't even expect two hawks to eat you. Don't even expect a 5v11 swan at this point in the game. That's right. Before friend attack, make the enemy target weak. Uh, that's anti synergistic with the raccoon. Unless I move the raccoon. Or the lionfish. If the lionfish is ahead of the raccoon, it's not anti-synergistic. But this seems really good. Better than the raccoon. So I think in the order, this will go weak first, then steal. So I think it will steal the weakness. So it is anti-synergistic. What I could do is this, though. As long as you don't get killed, we're fine. I could play it a bit safer and put you here instead, I suppose. And I tell you what, I don't mind the Lynx, either. Let me freeze Lynx, because I think I would sell the fish for it, but not right now. I need this turn. Some that uh, summon. Summon a chick with one health and half the attack of this. Okay, so that's still like that. Kind of just wasted six gold here, if I'm gonna be completely honest. If we're gonna swap stuff out, I'll get an owl. Nothing has a hurt trigger. I respect garlic. In this household, in fact, honestly, in this household, we very much respect garlic. Garlic, fantastic. Whoever discovered it, well done. Round of applause. You deserve it. Uh, by the way, goodbye, garlic. You have no more food in your squad, sadly. Okay. Fish, it's been an honor. Have a nice life. All right, well, buy, sell, owl. Okay, this swan... Seems to want to go to the end game. So you know what? I'll give you some of this. So the sum of my squad right now. 4, 5, 2, 2. Uh, I think that adds up to 13. Am I correct? <laughs> 13 damage to a random unit at this stage of the game. is probably just going to one-shot stuff. So let me run you here. You can just blow up a random unit. Tearing up the raccoon is... Probably not my next... Oh, maybe I'll keep it in. Oh, fuck it. We'll keep it in. At some point, we need to swap a unit out. I guess it could be the Hawk or the Lynx. Because the Hawk is doing more damage than the Lynx anyway. I guess it could be the Lynx. I don't really need to tear up on the Swan either, but... Hmm... Dragonfly, give plus one plus one to one pet of each level at the end of turn. That's scaling, I believe. Of each level. Four, two, two, four. Okay, we'd have to make some drastic changes because this is also a four. Okay, you eat the links, but that's fine. We accounted for this by putting the raccoon back another position. And the raccoon is going to steal nothing. Okay, the raccoon has to go. I really respect the raccoon as a unit. It's been fun. And I'm being sincere about that. You sadly have to leave. 
I'll pick up a swan. I'll pick up a dragonfly. So we're probably looking at losing the lynx and or the hawk as well. And a tier 5 doesn't really do me any favours right now. 4 is the problem. 3 is not a bad unit to grab though. Okay. Give me that. Sell that. Buy that. Not the greatest scaling the giraffe, but it's a tier 3. Yes, please. Maybe, please. Would I prefer that to the giraffe? Uh, yes, yes, yes. Yes. It's level, it's not here, I'm done. Uh, so it'll do one to the one, one to the two. All right, I'm gonna leap. I'm gonna leave it for now. That's okay. You hit the unit I didn't want you to hit, but <laughs> in both accounts. Oh, monkey is still here. Nice weakness, but I don't think it's going to matter. Come on, lionfish. Come on, giraffe. Okay, I'll take a, a tie after we kind of beans that last turn. Okay, so if it's of the level, then getting the unit to level 3, i.e. the swan, would be fantastic news. The giraffe is not necessary for the equation. And I can get the swan up a level. And I can get you up a level. The friend head repeats their ability in battle as if they were level one. So I could make the hawk do 21 damage instead, basically, but split. Also, I could get his coconut gun, it fires in spurts. If it hits you, it's going to hurt. Can I do a hurt trigger, though? Out of battle. I've not seen one. Let me freeze you for a second. Pilling an ant is too slow. Scorpion, gain peanuts. There's melon in the pack because there's a turtle, pill turtle. But I think I'm early enough that people won't have considered that yet. Yeah, sure, let's do it. Ideally, you don't hit the scorpion with the buff. Thank you. Okay, this works. Why have you melon? Okay, you're a genius. That's why you meloned your badger. to counter the snipe technology. You have no upgrade when you level, so there's no point in grabbing that. What the hell is the chicken like? Three, three. Well, yoink. Swan, you're coming with me till the end. If this is your highest pet, sorry, your highest tier pet, gain plus 15 attack and health. Do I go for it? I'm going for it. I don't think it's too late. And let's move the hawk around a bit because people seem to be having some anti snack technology. I'm tempted to run him at the front, honestly. Maybe try and snipe like a melon or a scorpion. Okay, melon. Uh oh. <laughs> that seems so par. 
Okay, one more defeat and we're out. Man, I wish I'd seen a monkey this pack. That would have hit the spot. Okay, we, we have to do a melon here. The White Tiger. Start a battle. Make one friend behind level 3. Except other White Tigers. It would be anti-synergistic with the Lion. I do like that I've got a Lionfish and a Lion. By the way. Uh, okay, I've deemed you a pointless strategy. Freeze the Chili. No, you don't move the needle for me. I think we Chili you. Unfortunately, my scaling isn't quite fast enough, is it better? Just a little bit slow in the old scaling. But we're going to break a melon, but then he's going to get it back. <laughs> oh, no, no, no. We die. Vultures. Friend faints, deal two damage. Eh, uh, okay. Pizza. Well, I think buffs is really where I'm at right now. Ideally on the lion. You're going to be too slow now. But I'll freeze in case I live. Yeah, sure. I feel a little bit too weak right now. Okay, it's a vulture build. It was nearly terrible. But the lion lived, baby. He, he's living. He's a liver. He's a liver! Nice. Ooh, baby. Uh, dragon my fly. Dragon my fly. Melon my lion. And I'm going to just keep shuffling this hawk around until I feel happy with it. And you know what? Hawk, enjoy melon. Yes. I think the lionfish getting chocolated is the play next round. If we can live there. Over the stats. Okay, that's a lot of melons. But I have a lot of melons too. And I broke your rooster early. It's fine. The coconut gone in fire to his spurs. I needed one more melon. I would have won. Okay. You know what? A six win game. Having been away for so long, I'll take it. All right, give me one more game. Uh. Sure. I'll be the the folded failures. Okay. Interesting strategy. You paid off for you. Well done. All right. <laughs> this seems a little bit cursed, but we'll go with it. By the way, I'm astonished to see the ant is still in the same place it was when I left it. I thought that was going to be changed. It seemed really strong. I guess it's struggling that line between, you know, being really strong to being, you know, broken. And I guess it's not broken, it's just very strong. Okay. Sure, give me an ant. I think a bear at this point is okay. I don't think it's great, I don't think it's terrible. I could put a toucan behind it. Hmm. Yeah. Sure. I'll leave the pill for now. I'll try and tear up the ant first. So the bear dies. This is how we change his synergistic effect. To be anti-synergistic. Because now my honey gets spread one more along. So I get an extra honey out of that interaction. Did it make a difference to how this all played out? No. 
not one bit. But it could have done. It could have done. Okay. Do I want you guys to be a part of the buff squad? Not really. Well, the two can I could justify. But I don't really want the frigate bird to be either. Nor the shrimp. But I think I'd prefer the shrimp over the frigate bird. I mean, ideally, I'd like a herter if I'm going to run or try and do the frigate bird. Uh... Don't hit the ant. Two piece. All right, it's boogie woogie time. Who drops for boogie woogieing? It might be the fish, honestly. Start turn discounts the two leftmost shot pets by one gold. Strictly speaking, it's synergy, but it's not exactly what I'm after. Okay, nor is any of this junk. We'll freeze the pill. I will take a meat bone. I'm actually going to move you around because I think the bear will perish shortly. And I'll put a meat on the toucan. Snap. Uh, yours is better than mine. Oh, well, not a lot better though. Alright, I take it back. Mine's better than yours. All right, sell it. Buy it. We'll pill this instead. I was toying with doing it with the ox, but I don't think I will. Buy it, combine it, buy it. Honestly, I approve of some of your choices there. Then I think I want to guarantee that the, the ant goes onto the melon dog. So I guess we'll just meet the otter. That's pretty good. He's only 1-2. Just make him a hard-hitting otter. Why can't you be six otters like... Uh, Sire Denathrius Druid? I'd much happily you split into six little tiny otters. That have a happy time. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Unexpected, but thank you. Pivot or not to pivot? That is not a question. I'm pivoting. Goodbye, shrimp. You can go to the front. You can go to the back. You pass your meat to these two units. I'm going to freeze the pill. The ant... If you can get combined next turn, I will do it and then pill you. Otherwise, you're getting pilled next turn. Uh-oh. Robbie Raccoon is stealing my meat. And has muted my build. Paul Bear, start a turn. Give a random frozen shot pet plus three plus three. Okay. I'll buy it. I'll buy it, game. Sell the frigate bird. Thank you for not hitting the dog. I will freeze you, buy you. Now, this is a hurt synergy that I don't want to use with the elephant. That seems subpar. We're going to move away from the dog, so let's ignore that for now. I guess... I mean, honestly, this would be pretty good value. Passing the melon along on the toucan. It's a bit of a weird build at the moment. You may have noticed. Oh, he can't pass Melon, I forgot this. Because it breaks in one, so he never passes it. Ah, that's that's the ticket. 
Okay, all buffs go to Mr. Porcupine. I would like him to work. Man, we could have really boogie woogied, by the way. Uh, I guess. Just accept you can't get maximum value out of this. The token is kind of pointless, other than the fact that it's like all my stats. We need another animal. Again, I've still not seen the monkey yet. They apparently exist. Oh, you're going to take meat off my porcupine. It's a garlic of my porcupine and put meat on it. Now, I do appreciate the porcupine is kind of garbage. <laughs> the more I thought about it, the more I, I realise it's kind of troll. Give rightmost friend plus two plus three. So it's where the dog is right now. All right, goodbye, dog. The reason it's kind of troll is because uh, if a unit is weak and hits it, it almost certainly dies. So the, the Pokemon effect doesn't go off. Or it's too strong that it just kills me in one. And then, again, nothing happens. I'm just considering. I guess we keep the pole bearing until like I absolutely need to swap it out. Summon a level 1 copy of a random friendly pet, except other tapirs. Uh, I guess this is for a faint build. Hmm. Doesn't really work for mine, sadly. Okay, here's the other... ...boldness. Should I go for a lion? I could buff the lion with the monkey and I have nothing else of that tier and the toucan is kind of anti-synergistic with what I'm doing anyway and I guess I roll three times no I think that's wrong you tempt me Hmm. Yes, two dragonflies. Uh, it's a lot of scaling. I do appreciate scaling. So, I think I'd go for it. It puts me in a bit of a, a questionable spot, really. What am I doing with this rooster, I guess, is the spot I'm in? Ha <laughs> ha! Take that! That being said, my strongest unit by far is dead. Okay, we're dead. And I have to win every game from now on. Okay, where's my rooster at? 11-9. That's not fantastic, honestly, but welcome to the squad. I need stuff for the now, really. How much are you doing now? Oh, I didn't mean to combine you. Okay. I need a pill. The pill is what moves the needle for me. We might be going just too slow right now. Also, why are you not gaining stats? Mr. Lion. Why was he not getting stats? He was the highest level. Give me one more. I, I know four in an episode, but I want to read the lion again because I feel like I've misunderstood something. Ah, please hit the ant. Thank you. Uh, will be the the purple ice cubes. No alliteration. This is a cursed run already. Not as cursed as that run. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. Okay, fish me. F fish me, ant me. Ah, 
Ah, the beaver got through a lot of my squad there. But it doesn't matter. The duck is cleaning up. Okay. Sometimes you get lucky, sometimes you don't. It's still a 5 3. Okay. <laughs> Why not? It seems like the thing build is potentially the strongest one. There seems to be like all the pieces of it are in the pack. But it's hard to say right now. Uh, we're going to tie this. I'll take it. Their build looked coherent. Okay. Right, fine. I'll buff you, Mr. Sheep. Hit the sheep. Close. I'll give you that. It was close. All right. <laughs> uh, I think... What do I do with my money here? I think I just combine. All right. That's perfect. That's exactly what I wanted. Okay, your build is remarkably good for this point in the game, but can you get through my big fish? Yes. <laughs> the answer is yes. Okay. We want a blowfish. We do not want an ant any longer. Garlic would be nice for the short term. Giraffe. Please hit the giraffe. Or the porcupine. I hate you. No. Yes. Right, the fish drops out. We wait for a pill. And then we're good to go. That's fine. I expected to lose that one. We basically did nothing last turn. Sell the otter as well, I think. So that elephant can get the buff. Okay. Now I think I want you here. I guess we keep the fish in the squad. I'll just throw a salad bowl. Please stop hitting that fish. I'm, I'm begging of you. We have to keep the fishing just for the 10 10 stats now. Okay. <laughs> Snap. We're trying to do the same thing. Oh, that's really smart. That's a good use of the pug. Holy shit. Uh, we look okay here. Nice. Pugging up the fish. The fish gives everyone a buff. Alright, that's smart. Hurt and think. Give friends plus one health. I will pill this ant. Did not mean to freeze you. Buy it. Interesting noise. Uh, I guess garliking you would be pretty good. Right, where are the pills? Where be my pills? I need thy pills. The ants must die. What's great do? Ah. Gold. Sure. Hey, big value out of that dude. And you called him a porcupine? He's the complete opposite of a porcupine. I'm a deal out. Okay. 
For Grapes to pay for itself, it would I'd have to keep it in the squad for three turns. Let's try it, because I think you're going to go eventually. And honestly, let's Broccoli you. Like, one more turn, and that's it. I'm going to sell the ant. Kind of a scary looking build, honestly. That's pretty brutal. Yeah. Weird having a bacteria at the back. Like, what if I'd sniped it? You would have had big sad times. Okay, it has to go. I know this means a pill is going to show up instantaneously. Nine gold. Freeze you. You're just health, right? Okay, never mind. I won't freeze you. I'll just play you. So that's two turns of giraffe. It's me, but stronger. I'm scared. We're going to trade. We're going to lose. God damn you. God damn you. All right, that'll do it for this episode. Let me know again if anything, you know, goes wrong with the recording. I'll try and check through it. I'll skim through it and see, you know, if anything looks completely horrendous. In which case, actually, you won't see this video. So by the virtue of you hearing this means I think it's okay. Okay, I must have had another T- Oh, I had the Lionfish, didn't I? They're both tier 5. And I had the Monkey, which is now a tier 5. It used to be tier 4. I understand. Okay, I see what's going with the Lion. My bad. Anyway, thanks a lot for watching, and I'll see you next time. Goodbye.